What is going on guys? My name is Chaotic and welcome back to another Grand Theft Auto 5 video. Now in today's video, I'm going to be discussing the brand new DLC that was released into Grand Theft Auto Online earlier today named Executives and Other Criminals and I'm going to be going over all the new content that has been added with this DLC. Now if you guys have not checked out any of the new content yet, or even played the DLC, then you are missing out. I'm not really too sure what you guys are waiting for, it is one of the best DLCs we've ever received in Grand Theft Auto Online, with some absolutely awesome content. So, let's go ahead and just get straight into this video. Now first of all, over the past couple of days, quite a few of you guys have been asking about the DLC, and which platforms it is available on. Now this update is only available on PlayStation 4, Xbox One and the PC. All gen consoles have not received this update as they cannot handle any more updates. But for those people that did receive the update, there are so many new cool features and items in the game which you can now take advantage of. Now one of these new features allows you to create your own criminal organization. So players with more than 1 million Grand Theft Auto dollars in their Maze Bank account can choose to become a VIP with the ability to create and name their own organization. And you can then hire up to 3 players to serve as bodyguards. To become a VIP and to create your own criminal organization, go onto the interactive menu and then find the option Securo Serve. You can also use the Securo Serve app on the mobile phone to join other organizations as bodyguards. Now VIPs of organizations can also drop ammo and armor for members, as well as order new vehicles on demand including the new turreted limo, as well as call in favors like Ghost Organization to temporarily remove the entire organization from the radar. Now joining an organization as a bodyguard has a number of advantages, one of these being that you receive a salary of 5,000 Grand Theft Auto dollars, you can also receive some additional cash and RP when taking on VIP work and VIP challenges that occur within free mode. You can also enjoy additional benefits including accelerated health regeneration, frequent RP bonuses and stat boosts when in the vicinity of the VIP. So this new VIP and bodyguard system certainly sounds very cool and by the sounds of things also there are many advantages to be gained on both ends. But anyway let's move on to some other new features and items in the executives and other criminals DLC. Of course we saw the introduction of 10 new stilt houses which are now for sale in the Vinewood Hills and these can be purchased from the Dynasty 8 website and all of these new houses are equipped with a 10 car garage and a heist planning room. There are also three new custom apartments for sale in the Eclipse Towers and these have eight customizable interiors. They are extremely cool and if you haven't checked them out already, I have a video on my channel where I do a tour of all the apartments. This new update has also added 10 new cars into the game, these being the Imponte Nightshade, the Bravado Via Lira, the De Classe Mamba, the NS Cognoscenti 55, the NS Cognoscenti, the Galavanta Baller LE, the Galavanta Baller Long Wheelbase, the Benefactor Shafter V12, the Benefactor Shafter Long Wheelbase, and finally, the Turreted Limo. There are also two new helicopters, these being the Super Volato and the Super Volato Carbon. There are also two new weapons, these being the Heavy Revolver and the Switchblade. Players can now also purchase a fifth garage or apartment. And finally, there is some new clothing and accessories available, including robes, smoking jackets, pajamas and swimwear. But one of the coolest features hands down that has been added into Grand Theft Auto Online with this update is the Super Yacht. So you can now purchase a super yacht from the Doc Tees website. There are three different types of super yachts which you can purchase. The cheapest one is $6 million. The most expensive one when fully upgraded is almost $10 million, but they are very, very cool. And if you guys get the opportunity and have the money to do so, then I would definitely recommend checking these out and buying one. Well, this update is definitely one of the best updates we have ever had in Grand Theft Auto Online. I'd even go as far as saying that this update is even better than the heist update, but that is my opinion. I want to get your thoughts and feelings on this. What do you guys think about the update? Let me know your thoughts and feelings about it by leaving a comment. It would also be greatly appreciated if you guys could also take a few seconds out of your day to click the like button, as it helps me out a lot and it's also greatly appreciated. And if you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, I'd really recommend that you do, because I upload all the latest and the greatest Grand Theft Auto 5 content. So once again, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys next time.